If you watch this video, you get a probably strong with money or want to eliminate wasteful standing. In this video, I will show you 10 ways to save money. I was able to save about 2 million yen this past year. However, some of the methods I'm going to show you may not suitable for your taste. Please do not use them and try to use all the methods that work for you. The first tip for saving money is to set a goal. The reason why this is important is that if you try saving money without setting a goal, you will not know how much to save and you will end up not saving any money. For example, if you want to save 1 million yen a year, you need to save about 80,000 yen every month. You won't save that amount every month. We will start thinking about how you should save. If you do not set a goal, the amount of money you can save each month will vary and you may end up overspending. The next tip for saving money is to keep a household account. Once you have set your goal, figure out monthly income and expenses. There is an old Japanese proverb that says, Tori kanjo yori tsukai kanjo. It means that people should try to do their best to increase their income, but rather than that, they should try to reduce unnecessary spending. I think this is the important lesson for those of us living in the modern world. In Japan, there is a service called Money Hall that allows users to manage their money in bank, credit cards, electronic money, etc. I have already started with this service. I check it about once a week. This way, the table and the pie chart show what I am spending my money on. As a supplement, there are apps such as men that have a similar function and also available in English. The next tip for saving money is to use a credit card for your purchases. If you make purchases with a credit card, you will be able to track your money in conjunction with services mentioned earlier. If you buy with cash, you have to manually register your spending, which is time consuming and you may forget to register. And if you buy with a credit card, you can earn points and save more money than with cash in many cases. Accumulated with about 10,000 yen worth of points for my purchases over last year. Credit cards are recommended, especially for expensive purchases. The next tip for saving money is to cancel subscriptions. Please cancel subscriptions and memberships that you are not using. As I was managing my money flow, I realized that I was paying big money for useless subscription services. The only ones I currently use are Netflix and Amazon Prime. I keep these services because I use them for learning English and shopping. If you are spending money on something every month, think about it for minutes. Are you really using that service enough? These automatic monthly payments are often overlooked and uh, require a bit of attention. You can save big by canceling services you are not using. The next tip for saving money is to stop impulse buying. However, both something on the spur of the moment and regulated it. Whenever I want something, I try to think about it for a few days before making the purchase. During that time, I think about the following. Am I trying to buy something to relieve stress? Can I replace with something else in my house? After a few days, the desire to buy often suppresses. The next tip for saving money is to relieve temptation. Television and internet advertisement try to get us to buy items in a variety of ways. Then we should reduce the number of times we are tempted. I have a TV, but I rarely watch programs. I use it as a monitor. If I want something, I look it up myself. 
Also, when I buy items online, I don't sign up for corporate email newsletters. If you are receiving an email newsletter that you don't need, unsubscribe immediately. The next tip to saving money is to avoid shopping at convenience stores. Have you ever bought snacks or bread or something by mistake where you intend to bust buy a drink? In Japan, there is a proverb that says, It means that even a small egg can add up to a big expense. So, how can we avoid the stops at convenience store? Just pick up a reason not to go to the convenience store. For example, uh, carry a water bottle with you, make a ready made meal or your dead home so that you don't have to buy any food after work. If you have to buy food and drinks, try to buy them at the inexpensive supermarket. The next tip for saving money is to sell what you don't need. Do you have things that you don't use now? If you want to save money, sell your unwanted items. In my case, I saw things that I used to be into but not anymore. For example, game software that I have completed or clothes that no longer fit my taste. The prices of things basically go down over time, so it is better to sell as soon as possible. The next tip for saving money is to buy used goods. Whenever I bought something new, I try to think about why it couldn't be used. New is prevalent for things like underwear as a consumable item, but many things can be used. For example, the camera and the lenses I used for my photography were purchased used. I bought them for about half the price of a new one. Of course, I did check the condition of the goods. New items are often more expensive because of advertising fees are added to the price. If you don't care about new items, you can save a great deal of money by buying used items. The last tip for saving money is to use things longer. I always try to use up what I have before buying new items. For example, I can still wear these clothes even though it's been 5 years since I bought them. I'm glad that I chose a simple design that doesn't get bored off. Also, this watch was purchased 10 years ago and I still use it. The habit of taking good care of things helps you save a lot. Today's conclusion. Thank you for watching. In this video, I have presented 10 ways to save money. Some of the things I introduced may not have been to your taste, so please try to incorporate only the one that suits you. Also, I would be very happy if you could give me a like button and subscribe to my channel. See you in my next video. Bye bye.